Assalamu alaikum my dear students, how are you? I hope you are all well by the grace of Almighty. Welcome to NIEV Somi School. I am Ashish Bishash, an assistant teacher of mathematics in National Ideal English Version School, Morning Shift. Today I am going to take a math class for the student of class 8. So my dear student, let us start our class. Dear student, today is our lecture number 25 of half yearly and today's SW number will be 17. And my dear student, our today's topic's name is exercise 4.3. From exercise 4.3, we shall solve 39, 42, and 44 as your CW. And 40, 41, and 43 will be your SW. So, my dear student, let us start your class. At first, please open your math book, page number 69. From that chapter, we shall solve uh, 39, 42, and 44. I have already written this question on the board. So, follow the board, please. Here, you notice exercise 4.3 resolve into factors that means some expression are given we need to resolve them into factors here 39 number is x cube minus 8 into x minus y whole cube so at first we resolve this expression into factors so first of all we write this thirty-nine here x cube minus 8 into x minus y whole cube so x whole cube and we written this expression as 2 into x minus y whole cube that means if we do cube of 2 then we get 8 and if we do cube of x minus y then we get x minus y whole cube that means now you notice a cube minus a cube and minus b cube formula is applicable here now we do apply of a cube minus b cube formula which is x minus 2 into x minus y okay and here we do second bracket because first bracket is present here for this reason we don't write here first bracket okay next we do third bracket cause we need first bracket and second bracket also in this expression okay so a minus b then a square a means x whole square then plus sign after that a b a means x and b means 2 into x minus y after that plus 2 into x minus y whole square okay okay now we do calculation x minus we multiply this 2 by x minus y both so if we multiply minus two with uh, two with x then we get minus two x this minus this minus will be plus two multiplied with y and it will be twice y okay and now notice x is square and twice x is multiplied with x and y also so first of all we multiply 2x and we get x minus y after that 2a square means 4 and x minus y whole square means x square minus 2xy plus y square. Then this third bracket. After that x uh, minus x plus twice y. Okay. That means if we subtract x from minus twice xy then we get minus x. And this plus two, uh, 2y is written here. After that notice x square now we multiply 2x with x and we get plus 2x square this plus and minus will be minus and 2xy now we multiply 4x square minus 8xy plus 4y square okay now here we can write this as twice y minus x and now notice x square 2x square and 4x square it is 6x square notice 2x square plus 4x square 6x square plus x square 7x square okay next minus 2xy minus 8xy that means we do addition and we get 10xy then 4y square is written here 
so dear student the answer is twice y minus x into 7x square minus 10xy plus 4y square i hope you have understood and this is the answer that means if we resolve x cube minus 8 into x minus y whole cube then we get factors twice y minus x into 7x square minus 10xy plus y square i hope you have understood next we shall solve a so easy math which is question number 42 42 question number is a x square plus a square plus 1 into x plus a now please a x square plus a square is multiplied with x and it will be x a square x and plus this x is written here if we multiply one with one with x then we get x and this a is written here after that we take common a x square and a square x that means from these two expression a x is common and left here x and here a now notice from plus x and plus a we take one as common and left x plus a now from the whole expression x plus a is common and here left a x plus one and this is the answer i hope you have understood and our last question of this lecture which is 44 so <coughs> at first we pick up this question 44 number question it is so easy but very very important for your annual term okay so which is a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3 a b a square minus 2 b cube dear student notice a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3ab square minus 2b cube if we want to keep it in a formula then we need minus b cube but here 2 minus 2b cube so we can easily write 2b cube as minus b cube and minus b cube right okay so we write this so a cube minus 3a square b plus 3ab square minus b cube and minus b cube okay next from this whole expression we can write this as a minus b whole cube and this b cube is written as minus b cube that means a cube minus b cube formula a minus b minus b then a minus b whole square plus a minus b into b plus b whole square now a minus minus b minus b means 2b that means a minus 2b after that we do calculation of this term that means a minus b whole square and it will be a square minus twice a b plus b square then a is multiplied with b and it will be a b and b is multiplied with b and it will be minus b square and plus b square dear student please notice minus b square plus b square that means these two term are card and a minus 2b and here a square after that we subtract a b from minus 2 a b and we get a b and this plus b square is written here that means dear student this is the answer so if we resolve a cube minus 3 a square b plus 3 a b square minus 2 b cube then we get factors of a minus 2b into a square minus a b plus b square i hope you have understood so dear student this is our today's cw okay now i shall give you some problems as your sw which are from the same chapter which is exercise 4.3 and they are 40 41 and 43 as your sw my dear student you must do your assign sw in your sw copy and submit it regularly in our school campus in every saturday within 9 am to 3 pm so my dear student i hope you have understood my today's lecture keep practicing at home abide by your parents see you soon till then assalamu alaikum